Praise the Lord, mighty prophet of the Lord. Amen, uh, Pastor Raymond, my son. The Lord has spoken with me. Yeah, about more than two weeks ago, the Lord did speak with me. Uh, again, Pastor Raymond, more than two weeks ago, the Lord Jehovah, our Creator, the God of Israel, did speak with me about uh, massive, massive, massive floods that are coming to this land. I've seen a lot of floods. I see trees that are broken and being pulled by heavy water. And uh, I see even the grass, the melala, the grass have slept. They, they have been swept and they are sleeping on one side, meaning the, the, the floods sweep them like a river. The rivers swell and the water flood and flow over the land. So there is going to be a very serious flooding coming to this land. Uh, more than two weeks ago, the Lord showed me that. And ever since then, I decided to hold it because of the thanksgiving for what the Lord did in Eldred. I decided to hold it before I can speak it with my breath. Uh, because of the thanksgiving of the mighty, mighty, mighty works that the Lord did in Eldred. But uh, now that uh, we have observed the thanksgiving, which is still continuing, which has no end. We will celebrate Eldred forever and ever. The visitation of Jehovah Yahweh, Jehovah Elohim, and how he removed many, many cripples from crippledness and desperation, how he removed the blind from total desperation and darkness and many, many other diseases. However, now I want to alert this nation that I've seen historic floods coming. I see trees swept by water down. I see a lot of grass lying on one side, a lot of water sweeping everything, which means there will be huge floods like rivers flowing, huge rivers exploding out also and flowing. However, when the Lord spoke with me about this more than two weeks ago, I began to pray. I began to talk to the Lord about the precious sheep of Christ in this ministry. And I went before the Lord and I told the Lord, please, even as it will bring death in this land, I asked the Lord to preserve very, very well and protect the people that belong to this ministry. The people that subscribe to holiness and righteousness at this hour. I asked him to protect them to protect their children, protect their property, protect their land, protect their being and livelihood. So this is the prayer that I've been making in the past two weeks as I go before the Lord. I've been speaking with the Lord, essentially talking to him and telling him, Lord, even as the floods that you've shown me are coming, preserve and protect your remnant. You are wholly elect. And that's why I also delayed to bring this before you uh, when it was spoken by the Lord more than two weeks ago. So right ahead of this nation, there are tremendous floods coming. I see a lot, a lot of trees that are going to be swept down. A lot of trees, a lot of grass are going to be brought down by floods and many homes are going to be swept away. Cities and things are going to happen. However, the faithfulness of the Lord is also going to be realized. The Lord is going to faithfully protect his own. I have spoken with him with my prophetic tongue. I went before him and I spoke with him. And I told him, Lord, as that which you have shown me comes to pass, please, the way you protected the Noah, the family of Noah, the righteous people, I ask you to protect the people in this ministry of repentance and holiness, the precious sheep that have subscribed to holiness and righteousness of this hour, that have rejected sin and immorality and lies and all the decay of this day. So I am speaking to this land. I'm speaking this prophecy that I've seen a lot of floods coming, historic floods, devastating floods. They will ravage this land. They'll bring a lot of death in this land and destruction. However, the people of the Lord, the Lord will preserve you. He's going to protect you, those people that have subscribed to righteousness and holiness, that it may be known that Jehovah is God. Shalom.